Rose Barbados 246 and I just want to get a little um, information as to what the what was it about, what how long have you been doing it and you know. Well actually well Rose Barbados, we tried actually starting from roasting everything, but we only like three months into it, so we started with roast fruit, which has been going really really good. So we ain't actually get to the other stage yet because the breakfast will be doing so good. Um I look at doing it for a long time. I also like that. To so touch the crop over, season is my basic idea. That was the idea at first. And I'll start this thing to hit crop over. All the crop over events. Crop over events. A lot of people coming everything. into Barbados and want to try this real spare food. So my target was to push on the Instagram and social medias, get them into it. But my crop over here is a thing. But it really, really stepped off. Knowing that somebody was doing it before too, it really, really, really just stepped off. So I've been going from to know. Okay, um, so what is it that do you think separates you from the other competitors right now? What's the Barbados experience? Oh, been? well, from young, this will be like saying I'm a little secret recipe, but from young, <laughs> I always love roast bread food, always. Mm -hmm. So the days on the, um, on the road, I stop with roasted bread food, they will come and wait me every time you know what the bread food is done because every day to always make the sauce and stuff like that. So that's where you get the idea from. I think how you put it into what put all the butter first, how you put all the ketchup, put in the veg, put on the top. So I think the, the fact that the butter is going there like all cemented is joy in it. But my mom is who actually prepares the food and everything. Well, that, that old style, the old school. Yeah, 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 yeah. So that got everybody hooked right now. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Okay, and what are the plans? You mentioned um, things, other things you want to roast any um, plans for expansion, what are you plans for the future? Yes, of? actually, because we started a roast fish. Mm -hmm. and it went good, but I can tell you the barefoot right now is so much that no one is only on the barefoot for a long time. They can get to a stage where they can say, well, I got that part covered, I am master yet. So some days it's still be the hectic, you know, it's still rushing, you got out estimate time. So when I can master the breadfruit thing, then I plan to move on to something else. And I also plan to see it like the next five years is still doing this still. You know, you can never expect everything. Like, turn out like this, this turn out really, really good. Cool. Mm -hmm. People love roast bread. You even love roast bread. Yes, I do. <laughs> I do, most yeah. definitely. <laughs> yep, yep, yep. Alright, so it's good for you today. So the menu is roast bread fruit and roast salt fish. Bread. So we had salt fish too and frizzled. We also had tuna today. Cooked tuna. Okay. This is you know fish only today, no fish other meats. Only, yeah. Usually it's been like big tails, um, steam frying fish. You know, we train different things as we go, but still not to touch the competitor, what they do, we try to be different still in a way. After all, it's not any competition for me or anything, but it's like, it's full spray fruit all over the country, you know? Yeah. Who, whoever decides to do it, do it. Yeah. Once we come up with an idea that's selling to the public, that like the public like, because everybody can do raw spray fruit. I guess that the big thing is the topping with the pigtails or... Yes. Yeah, yeah. you honestly think it's that. That's the best part about it. And it's a good business, so if you're there, you know, you, you can get up and move. And my shirt says, get up and move, you can try it out. So this is what it looks like to roast a bread fruit. My first time, my first time roasting a bread fruit ever in my life. But, are you going to try a bread fruit? Before you go on camera. Yeah. Yeah. Looks good. She will try it live for you guys. And I can't lay. My face can't lay. So is that, is that for you to come and try it now? Mm -hmm. I, want to, I want to say thanks for you guys still for the idea because then it was the idea of you guys to come over and you know, see what's going on. Help me to share what I have going on as well too. So I want to say thanks to you guys as well. You are breadfruit. Just tell me if you want breadfruit. Breadfruit.